house. Boiler well, no number five Chanel. When the back of the fire bird and fly as hell. Keeping ain't nobody speaker in front of the footwell. When I run with it rings like the fire bell. Hey guys, what a welcome back. Yo, we're gonna jump onto some Stalliano and E2 with some Southwest. Thanks for being watching, requesting, liking, commenting, doing all the good stuff. Yo, we're starting this shit with a little bit of Grey Goose. Just get the bottle out. And a bit of a smirk. Let's go, man. Bro. Bro. Got some G from cooking this bitch. From haters in my face, cars, I was trying to prove shit. Shout out to my teachers who said, I'll never do this now. I'm out here in the charts and they listen to my music. Got my doctor's Bruh. Shout out to my teachers who said I'd never do shit. Now I'm out here in the charts and they're listening to my music. Yo, those teachers are the ones that give me motivation when they said, Yo, you'll never amount to anything. Now look at me. They're watching on. Jealous. But yo. This is, this is the second day in a row, yeah, where I've started my intro and I've said something that completely coincides with the first word spoken. So yesterday I did uh, a track by Wombat and I was speaking on some religious stuff. First word spoken, all religious. Today I was speaking, you know, only because I saw him doing it, and a bottle of Grey Goose in his hand. First words, yo, we're smoking, we're sipping up that liquor. Bruh, I'm getting good at this. It's only took me three or four years, but I'm, I think I'm starting to make it now. Oh, can't forget about my tacos up in NZ. They ain't playing if somebody rocks up to their ends. Oh, these guys out there. Yo, I, I like it. I, I like. I just like it when people rep where they're from. Just, just love that shit, man. The other four six boys, Kim's out there. Yeah. Oh. Yo, do you know what? I really, really, really like this G Funk sound. Yo, the 046, bro. I think 046 like resurrected that G Funk sound. And dudes out there in the 685 representing, representing that G Funk, You're bringing it back. Old school, old school sounds. You can't beat some old school sounds. We're some bloods, but we keep it on the left side. Ooh. Oh. Bro, if they test, if they test me, I might just have to spray it and walk away with the Tech Nine. Just um, it's not even a drive-by. I'm just walking up, shooting, and walking off. Like, like a little mic drop, walk up, shoot, walk off, mic drop, done with that Tech 9. I like the fact that you brought a Tech 9 into it because uh, the real Tech 9, the rapper, actually follows me, which is one of my claims to fame. Mine, I 
love, so you know I'm feeling lipstick. I'm with another bag, but it's all part of me. And mother the media label me as a menace. Cause I'm tired like a mother when they see my appearance. Hit a spit, I act right, or you smoke like a rasta. I play your position, it could be nine impostor. Cause we're really for this with the. Yo, you better act right, I'll get smoked like a rasta. <laughs> What I'm thinking is, yeah, you need if you're gonna step, you need a step correct. If you don't know the ends that you're in, just just walk in there and respect everybody that you walk into. Because if you walk into the wrong place and you don't come with the right attitude, you you ain't making it out of there. Shit, man. Shit, don't don't be wanting no smoke. Don't be thinking you're fucking Snoop Dogg or Bob Marley smoking up and out. Cause you'll just end up getting smoked. Really lifted. Fucking bringing Stevie Wonder into it, man. Oh, any any time somebody talks about not being able to see or a blind person, it's either Ray Charles or fucking Stevie Wonder get brought into it every single time. But he even said it that he even said it there, man. Back to what I said. Step correct, you get put on that jumper, get put on that t-shirt. Fucking candlelit visuals everywhere for you. <sighs> Who else? Kim has he got in his hand there? Is that, that medicinal? Do you know what? I honestly think that... Well, you know that I think that music from Australia is fucking underrated. But you know... <laughs> Dude, you dudes from fucking New Zealand, man, you you are bringing the shit. Uh, there's a lot of underrated stuff out there. There's a lot of unheard stuff. There's a lot of... Bruh, do you know what? I, I need to do a lot more stuff from New Zealand. I need to start representing a little bit more. Might be able to get myself a little plane ticket, a little tour of the island, you know what I mean? Get that sorted out for next year. <laughs> right, guys, that's that one done. That's that one done. Yo, go listen. Just go listen. Go listen to stuff that I listened to before. And honestly, it's better than 99% of that stuff in the mainstream. See you guys up next one.